Hello, Internet! And today, we're gonna do something weird. We're gonna fondle Zakok. Well, it's a hawk, guys. It's a hawk. I don't even know why people call him Zakok, but apparently that's the case. People just call him Zakok. So apparently, after the E and above, he's like stupidly good now. I mean, I'm not a big fan of him, of course, you know. I like lollies, he's not. I'm not gonna fully model him, but honestly, I think he's worth it from what I've heard. And yeah, I mean, at least get the S1 as well. His S1 actually does a lot of damage. But anyway, in my case, I got 282 speed on. I got okay enough attacking crit damage to probably kill something with execute. And yeah, we'll try and murder some A-Rabbies or some lollies. I, 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 I don't know. By the way, after farming in the back for so long, I realized something. I really love farming. I do. So I decided to actually farm. Real Farm is an agriculture simulation metaverse game service in korea for 10 years this is the game where you can just not farm for equipment it's like epic 7 you get to actually farm like how your ancestors did in the field but you're actually in your room because it's a mobile game you get to nurture your plants and if you collect coupons while you are gaming you can actually use the coupon to exchange them for farm produce that's right you get it for real. That's actually incredible. I'm writing the script right now. And I'm like, holy cow, you get it for real just by gaming? If you harvest crops, you can sell them. And yeah, there's actually a real-time price change based on the sales volume. So it's pretty interesting. Needless to say, it is not a game where you just plant and harvest. But it's also a game that adds reality of farming into it. It allows you to experience actual farming like giving plants nutrients, making them wet temperature and all that stuff in between once you master it you can actually you know game get a coupon and you actually get to redeem produce real life users who have signed up for the giveaway can win goods from the prize pool which is worth five thousand dollars of real fresh meat vegetables and fruits pre-registration is exclusively available to access in the u.s so yeah let's pre-register real farm and receive real fresh products you farm in the game you farm in real life download real farm right now link in the description and today we have a war against someone we can all relate to, Scamgate. Right, here we go with round one. This will be like, <laughs> if he pulls this off, then Zakok is crazy. But he's against two underage and one overage. So I'm going to plow my Zakok onto the overage girl. And if I can murder this, the rest are all dead to my cock. Oh, great. I'm definitely not weird. But yeah, we have double speed imprint. I'm 283. So double speed imprint meaning I'm 303. I'm fast as fuck, boy. Should be it enough to raise the girl. And yeah, apparently he does a lot of damage. We'll try and, and S2, get the attack of S3 instantly and see if we can kill her. If we do, we just win. If we don't, we just instantly lose. But you know what? Let's trust the Zakat. His S2 also pushes an ally. So I'm thinking to push like Sid. I'm not sure how that would go. We'll see. Round two. We're gonna die here, but we'll die in style. We got a bomb squad. I I'm so addicted to using the bomb squad in arena. Like, I just kept spamming it. I, I didn't stop. The idea I have here is we'll pop the bomb, pay route speeding, and after that, we're gonna get magic for friends, then we're gonna die. Well, we're not gonna die. We're gonna get like, close to dying, and then fire is gonna self attack up, so there's no evading the rimmer, so she'll, 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 she'll die. But yeah, hopefully everything just turns out well. <laughs> Jinru, let's go. I'll put another zero behind your O. Right, here we go. We do outspeed this time, and well, guess what? <laughs> Yo, this is so nice. We get to push the Sid to get him to turn here, and I'm not sure if I wanna get Sid or the Sherry. I, I guess. Sid. We'll get Sid up. Sid will kill one. Oh, oh. He bust attack on Sid. Oh my god, that's broken. Okay, I can see why the cock's crazy. Right, let's see now. We have 100% crit rate. I mean, I've got like 68, which is like overkill. But I just have crit chance on my gear, guys. I can't do much. But he innately has 50% crit chance, so this should absolutely crit. And yeah, the question, the real question is, will I kill the Sybil Unity and Pensed? I'm gonna say no, considering this girl's so slow. Oh my god. Okay, big. very close. You know, give me a bit better gear. I would have done it, but anyways, we're, we're still fine. Right, we're gonna kill you here. Thank, thank God for there's a cop push. So, I guess you could say it's a cop push to Sid from behind. Oh, not like this. I mean, I've got evasion. You're not. Yeah, yeah, you little shit. All right, let's kill the mouse before she kills my family. And now we're dealing with a war god. I'm not sure how I'm gonna deal with this, but I guess so many is a good start. We'll try and actually do that. Let's just see how much damage this will do. I have no bullets on it. It still does like what? Seven point something k. It'll be like ten ish k if I actually bullet it. So hey, pretty damn good. Pretty damn good. All right, now just don't counter me, and we are. Good. Wait, are we dying? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, we're not. <laughs> Sid, how ironic. Your skill is called hack because you're just pure hacks. Oh, God, how is that fair? All right, Zakat. Wow. I mean, I didn't bullet the S2, but if I did, it would have pushed Sid enough to like 100%. So that would have been perfect. But anyways, yeah, I, I definitely should bullet it. I, and I mean, you know what? After doing that, 
I want to mono it now. Holy crap, that's so nice. Are we plan to bombs on everyone. I'm pretty sure. Pirate Captain Flam buffs attack first, right? Yeah, she buffs attack first, so I will not be able to evade um, Rimuru anyway, so I might as well go get into stealth. Uh, actually, I think I have to do this anyway. We'll do this, we'll get the attack buff, get into stealth, get the barrier as well. Now we'll plant all the bombs and the burns and everything. We'll have to eat a match of friends and a Rimuru, though. I know we're gonna eat a match of friends. Like, come on, show me. Yep, I fucking knew it! And the question is, can Land survive with, you know, the, the damage sharing? If she can, then it'd be- <gasps> She did! Oh my god, that's so perfect! It's proof of value, Rimuru, so let, let's make sure we kill that. And that will kill everyone, or stun everyone, or just, you know what, just kill everyone. This is the spawn. The summertime is here, and they're like, you know, squishies. We're gonna squish them like SpongeBob. Bang! Oh, oh, oh geez. Alright, we might still absolutely die here. <laughs> well, I have. I have Summertime and Serious Artifact on her, so I could technically plant a bomb and bomb. Oh, fuck. Yo, counter attack out of nowhere. Okay, good. We win. <laughs> Not close at all. Please don't counter now. Not now. Okay, yo, there we go. Boom! ML Flat doing the job. Oh, yes. I have no clue how much I want to use her. Like, she's just too thick. I'm so glad I could use her now. Here we go in round one again. Honestly, I like the single target thing I'm doing. Bro, if I had the bullets for Zakok, I actually do, but I really don't want to do it. I mean, I don't think I'll be using him just because he's Zakok. Wait, it's so nice. I get to push Sid. I get to tap off him, uh, him as well, and then I get to just nuke one out of water. It doesn't matter if you're fire. I can still hit you. Like, I'm not gonna miss a similar unity. Or I can just, you know, nerf a rally so hard, or I can just one-shot the flat. There's so many options. Holy crap. What are we gonna do exactly that. Round two. <laughs> if we're talking about risk and how ironic I'm facing your guy called Worry. Definitely not worried about this. But I'm basically tampering with death. Got a reviver protected by this. Basically, you need like, what, six hits to kill her? Oh no, I'm exaggerating. Maybe four hits. Actually, maybe three. I, I don't know. But yeah, I want them to kill me so I can bring Dom back and then, I don't know, maybe unworried the worry? And yeah, there's this girl that's gonna debuff my entire team, but I have a soul baby recently to get an extra turn and get a buff in. So that's the entire idea I have. But yeah, it's, it's really risky and stupid, but you know what? His name Worried. He's probably not not too confident. Yeah, oh my god, that's a flan right there. Wait, so what I'll do again, I'll push the Sid. Dude, the attack buff on the Sid. I didn't even know she did that. I didn't. I thought he only self attack buff and pushes allies. But you dispel two debuffs and you increase attack and you push CR, bro. Anyways, Sakar will hit a fire dish. He's pretty much an ML5. Like, you can't miss it. You, you can't miss any inner fire dish with him. So, bang, that's a death. Oh my god. Do you note that this thing is supposed to have like sort of like an innate proof of value, something like that. Basically, it's a lot of crit damage reduction, but Zakok just still kills it. Yo. It's too good. It's just so good. I just one tapped the kid. Oh my god. All right. Now, Shuri, we're gonna shoot some females. Sounds so wrong. Like, this entire video just sounds so wrong. We got Zakok. We got, we got people shooting, you know, kids and girls. All right. Round's gonna go. Everything's according to plan. You're gonna do this. I thought the BB was gonna be fast because, you know, the way they set it up, but guess not. You are not even killing my Domitio. What? In that case, eh. I don't want to do S3 because I kind of wanted to kill me. So, you know what? I'll do S1 for now. Oh, I should have got rid of the kill though, but eh, it's okay. So, this will go. We'll get wrecked, but I, I got a soul burn. Ah, so, like, we should be fine. So, what I'll do is I'll get rid of Ron's skill though, which I should have done with Dom. Actually, no. This is fine. Now, I'll do this. I just realized this is so stupid. Oh, wait. Yeah, this is really dumb. Wait. They should have killed Dom. Why is Dom alive? Wait. My plan revolves around you dying, Dom. Wait. <laughs> Right, now fake. Koza's definitely dead. <laughs> like, like, no, no, no doubt about that one. So that's it. Oh, don't holy sack. Oh, if you're gonna holy sack, please. No, don't have higher HP, bro. Hey, one tap that. You are so good, Celine. I want you to be my wife. Right, now, mission save the Dominial. There's no way. I mean, if you some of us are this. Oh my god, save the Dominial. Done. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. I can't, I can't believe that worked. All right, so this is the definition of living on edge. Look at this. Like, I have to die like six times just to get the win. All right, that was nice. Done. Okay, so cock is actually broken one. You guys watch me do RT at all? I, I basically do single target cleave a lot, so I, I think Zakat could be in there. I don't know. We'll have to find out. Right, round one. We're doing this again. <laughs> Honestly, we probably would lose this. It depends on how much Warhorn would, like, impact the game, or I don't know. We'll see. The idea is if I can kill the car rig, everything just dies. So yeah, Zakat pushing Sid again. Maybe I'll push Watch the just for the lols, but you know what? I want my cock behind Sid instead. Uh. My cock will do a lot of damage on the hat. And then Sid will just finish it off, and yeah, we should win that. Round two, the bomb comp. I love this. It's my favorite thing. I mean, there's ML Leo, but who gives a shit about this guy? Like, look at him. Just rile it without all the edginess and coolness. Right, here we go. We do have speed, surely. We do. Now we are... I'm not sure. Do I get the attack up for Sid? 
Sid, or do I get a top of four? Uh, I'll, I'll give it to Sid. I want my cup behind a squirrel. Right, now we're gonna hit a Giga Damage onto the hand by cock to your hand. Let's see who's stronger. And bang, we do quite a bit. Durandal can't endure this. Right, so we'll kill the hand. I mean, it's kind of shame because I want my cock to defeat the hand, but I guess cocks don't ever defeat the right hand. Right, dead. It's both dead. Now we got Sheree alone. If you counter me here and get Arya back, I might lose, but... Oh, I guess we're fine. Right, can we finish this with the cock? Right, we got a soul bird. If I have Bola, I'm pretty certain I would have killed this. Oh, you are, you are actually countered now. Oh, God. Wait, if I had Bola, I probably would have killed that. But you know what? It's fine. So, yeah, I mean, Sid did like, what, 13k there? So, Zaha could have probably done about the same on Soul Burn one. So, that's like, I don't know if that's to say Sid is broken or is Zaha good. <laughs> I think it's just a mix of both. All right, we'll strip everything. Oh, of course, you have ER on Alencia. Right, we're going to get into the stealth. Now, there's no bombs on, uh, on a kid. On one of the kids. I mean, both of the kids. Yeah, there's no bombs on both of the kids. We are going to plant the bomb here. I mean, Alencia, I, I don't mind Alencia taking the turn. It's not going to one-tap me. But the shoe, definitely not. I don't want to. I don't want the shoe to do anything. Well, I could stop that by just planting a bomb here. Oh, my God. 75, dude. Oh, dude, I can't. It's fine. We're still fine. Believe it or not, we are still fine. We're going to get this. Hopefully, you don't counter. But, uh, hopefully, you don't get countered here. And we don't. So, that's nice. And Flash should take the turn. Oh, fuck. We did not, in fact, take the turn. But we can steal their defense buff. So, that's something. All right. Uh, I don't know what to do. Yeah, here's what I'll do. I'll get rid of your defense buff. Oh, I actually did it. <laughs> oh, my God. Flash, go crazy. And with that nade as well. Dude, that's such PM. That's such PM. You just you just completely destroyed that. Yo. All right. I need I need you to be stunned. Back. Get the stun and done. Now, we'll need a lot more bombs on the shoe, because if the shoe takes the trade, it's over. So, bang, we, we, we got a bomb there. So no, no bombs there. Now, I'll have to detonate this one, and we do. Bang, God. Oh, my God. Flat, you're crazy. Dude, that's crazy. I'm telling you. That's so good. Right. I mean, if I kill the lens here, I just win. But just so I don't have to look at your dumbass animation, I'm killing you first. Right. This should kill you. Bang. God. Oh, my God. Go crazy. <laughs> Jeez, Flat. Chill, Flan, chill. All right, now I got this again, so it should be over. We'll get the bomb in as well, and we will get the... Uh, what's the word, man? We'll get... Oh, we actually... We let you have as well. You're so dead, though. Can I BM him even more? Yeah, fuck it. Let's go. All right, you know what? That That's too much over... Yeah, it's too much. Okay. Now, I don't even... I don't have to detonate. I'll just have to plant as much bombs as I can, and I'll detonate with... I mean, I'll do this, and then I'll shoot the kid, and she'll die. But you know what? Of course, we're gonna get the whole One Piece crew out and shoot you together, right? So, bang, get the bombs, and it burns in. Done. And guess what? Guess what? Dual attack with... Ah, oh, okay. No. Over here, over here? Yeah, yeah. Over here, over here. Pirate Captain Flan. Not even in your video, but you're just doing everything. Triple bombs with a bird with potential to plant a fourth bomb. And let's see if you do and you don't. But, I mean, what? We're gonna do, like, what? 12, 13k damage here? 20. Sheesh. Oh, I love that. That was delightful. Dude, that felt flat so fun. Stupidly risky, but stupidly fun. Right, so that was Zakak. I'm sorry if you're annoyed by me calling him Zakak, but literally any everyone calls him Zakak, not just me. But yeah, I would rather, of course, the final story. I mean, if you're if you're wondering what that what you get, you get crit chance, a bit of flat attack, of course, but the crit chance doesn't really matter, so I I I ought to not do it. I mean I can't even do it. I don't have enough like the green stones. If you can do this build with maybe 30 more crit damage, then I think you're good. But regardless, I think, yo, he's so good. What? I mean, I mean, you're not gonna pick him unless you like play aggressively, I don't think. Actually, you might be able to still just do him. Uh, do not do him. Oh, chill, daddy. You might be able to just pick him against like boosters as well. Like, you know, just, just wreck like a well of 50% of health or like an A Ravi, just gone 50% injured. Well, 35. So yeah, Zaha is actually pretty damn good. Holy crap. Rap, I'm surprised. I didn't know she was, he was that good because, I mean, he's a dude. I kind of pay no attention. But yeah, god damn. It's probably like the best unit off of this buff, I think. But yeah, that's all for today. Leave a like, enjoy, and subscribe to the channel. Have yourselves a wonderful day. And take care.